the Elisha Abo incident <laughs> really <laughs> secured your rage. <laughs> Why? That was the senator who is. I know, I know. I know. I'm telling the public who yes. was alleged to have assaulted a woman mm. in public, in a public place, who is still, I think, a serving senator. Crazy country, right? Mm. Um, I don't know where that wrong species of male <laughs> is from, you know? I, I think that for you to serve in any public office, mm. You should have, okay, so maybe none of us can claim to be saints, but mm -hmm. you should have a good enough CV, especially in how you relate with other, other people. people. How do you explain a man who claims to be married, mm. beating up a woman in public, mm. then you put him as patron of a group of people who yes. are considered Influencers. Yes, that's at the Actors Guild. Was, I mean, yes. like, how, like, how? Even now, thinking about it, mm. it's crazy. Mm. Mm. It's crazy. Mm. Whether he apologized or not, which he didn't, because I don't see anyone that I can use as, um, what do they call the precedent, right. to say people read apology. Right. You didn't read the beating. Why are you reading the apology? Right. You should be able to apologize off cuffs because yes, yes you apologize and it's from your soul. Right. It's not it's right. not some mouse thing. Right. So it's not you're not you're not saying no oh, anybody that makes such a does such a thing is condemned. You're no. saying atone for it properly. Finish. I have deliberately created a demarcation between Hilda the person yeah. and Hilda the actor, mm. producer, director, anybody in public face. Even as a public servant, I made sure that my family was left mm. out of my work. Mm. The reason is, based off of experience, mm. I have not seen any family that put itself in public glare that is together as a family. Mm. No, I'm not going to subject my children to that rubbish. Mm -hmm. I will not. I'm not going to make my children uh, miss meat for anybody. Whatever you bring up on social media is like what you bring, on, bring into the beer parlor. Anybody mm -hmm. can say anything. My family is special. Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness me. They are mm -hmm. special. They're very private. And mm -hmm. it is their right to have their own lives. Right. And I'm not going to allow my own life Medal India's hell no. My father, mm -hmm. may his gentle soul rest. Mm -hmm. And I had a kind of relationship that I had promised that I was going to keep my maiden name for life. Mm -hmm. Whether I got married or did not get married, right. I was going to keep that name. So the bargain with whoever was going to take me as wife mm -hmm. was also that that's Dokubo will be there. Now, the reason is very simple. I'm first daughter, on average, mm -hmm. I can choose not to. Right. Okay? Right. Um, tradition gives me the right not, not to. Right. So, but if I choose to, mm -hmm. then I was going to maintain my last name. Right. But at this point, there was also the need for people to know that, oh, she was not wayward and there's no baby daddy, daddy, baby right. story going on. Yeah. So that pregnancy you see yes. is legal. Right, yes, yes. <laughs> it's legal. Yes. So, yes, so we threw up the, the name um, because I got real, properly married, three levels, <laughs> traditional court and church. church right. So... Yes, right. and so it came up. Right. But we also got to a point where he realized that we were having issues of identification. Huh. So when you get to a place and you say, um, I'm from Mrs. Mrakbo, they're lost. Like, oh, wow. who the hell is that? <coughs> right. Right. Okay, so he sat down a few times in a few places mm -hmm. and... He saw. He saw. 
Thank you for joining our YouTube channel. I know, I hope um, you loved that video and you connected with it. Don't forget, please subscribe, please like, please share with your friends and family. Please comment. We love to see your comments and to see the full versions. Join our community right now or past episodes on watch.withtoday.com. Let's be human together.